Hey guys, it's Ted Bogert. Welcome back to the Ted Show. I'm excited for this event. A Halloween on Church Street is coming up October 22nd uh, down on Church Street. Michael Westmeyer, who's over here, uh, is going to give us the details on that. But I have two special guests. You're special. More special guests today. We have Jackie Ewing and we have Michael Frodima. Uh, Jackie, Jackie is the Ewing family security and staffing services and michael for is with sit shine uh, we have a little tasting behind you if you haven't seen that you all these events are great this one is benefiting uh base camp children's cancer foundation uh, and so these two gentlemen are providing some things that are very important to your experience and we'll be talking about that but we're also going to be tasting some of the goodies that michael from sip shine has brought welcome gentlemen how are you today Hello, Ted. Hello, gentlemen. Thank you for coming. Thank you for having us. I'm, I'm happy you're here, and I'm super happy Michael brought some things for me to taste. Um, so before we get into it, I love introductions, and the audience does too. So Michael, tell them just a little bit. Of, Michael Westmeyer, tell them a little bit about you, and we'll kind of go this way. Well, you guys know me. I'm with Maverick Events. been doing real estate with my wife, and we'll try to get this event a nightmare on Church Street to be a wonderful experience for everybody, and it's going to, of course, help benefit Base Camp for Kids. Today, I'd like to show off two of our great participants here. We have our security guy, Jackie Ewing, and we have Sip Shine. Michael here is going to show us some of the tasty stuff that we have on this table. So we're really excited to have them at the event and uh, see what they got for us. Exciting. All right, Jackie, you came in the later the one, the, la the first one to start. Jackie, tell us a little bit about uh, you and what you're doing for A Nightmare on Church Street. Okay, cool. Well, Michael, thank you. I appreciate it. Um, Ted, I appreciate you having us on here. Absolutely. Um, Michael, I'm sure you know something. Yeah, <laughs> great, great to try out. Tasty drinks. We'll be able to. Um, but yes, again, I'm Jackie Ewing, um, the owner of the Ewing Family Security and Staffing. Um, Michael has brought us in as a security provider for the event. Um, and, you know, just want to be able to express ourselves to, you know, City of Orlando. Um, we are a small business, uh, but we have been around for five years. And this event is just one of the many we've done under our umbrella over the last years so hey and for you guys who have asked as we've done these shows hey what's security going to be like downtown um here's your man right here so it's you're going to be protected not have to worry about that i know there's been a lot of news out there about what the city's doing uh downtown especially in the church street area uh so you can put those fears aside and get out to a nightmare on church street all right thank you jackie Michael Frodima, tell us about you. Yeah, so I've been with Sip Shine about four, going on five months now. I'm uh, loving the new new job that I have. Um, ready to get some, a lot of new uh, brand exposure out for the product, stuff like that. And uh, we're always looking forward to the event. And we're going to try some products out right now and see what he we gets, think. He gets right to it, guys. So thanks to Sip Shine uh, for doing this. We appreciate it. Thank you, Jackie, for being here. Obviously, I want to be protected while I'm drinking Sip Shine um and i want to make sure that all the crowds are in control so we've got this down maverick events has done an amazing job and we're bringing back a nightmare on church street after 20 years so exciting stuff all right so let's get to the tasting you guys this sip shine has uh some things that look like a seltzer that are not uh they have whiskey they have a lot of things so i am gonna let instead of my liver talk i'm gonna let michael talk uh and give us kind of the 411 on what we're gonna be tasting yeah, sure. So we have uh, three different uh, Sip Moonshine products. So you can, I don't know if you can see them They're in the can here. Um, if you guys want to yes. come over and try them out. Yes, we're going to try. Uh, so tell us what we're trying first. Yeah, so we're going to go ahead and try out the uh, Arnold um, Shiner, which is more like a lemonade flavor. Uh, it's good, good when it's really cold. Um, so All right, let's do it. Yes, tell me which one I'm grabbing. This one here, yeah. Michael goes right. Look at him. He could be Vanna White. He could be. All right. So this is the lemon is the Arnold Palmer. Arnold, Arnold Shiner. Uh, it's, people generally relate it to an Arnold Arnold Palmer. Okay. Uh, right. It's more like a lemonade, tasty flavor. Uh, oh, it's yummy. You can drink it, drink it on ice. You could put lemonade or any kind of juice that you prefer. That is uh, so good. So tell us about the 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 Shiner. Tell us about um, the product itself. It's a mixture of alcohol yeah and so it's a whiskey based product a white whiskey um you can call it whiskey you can call it moonshine in a can whatever you prefer um there's some oh here comes vanna white again come on up vanna 
bring it, bring it. So you get an idea of what the packaging looks like. Comes in the four pack cans. You can find it at a lot of the liquor stores. The flavor is delicious. The, the flavor is absolutely delicious. And what I love is that it's your spin on the other drink. I won't even call it that. Um, this is really, really good. What's the alcohol content? Because you know uh, everybody's going to ask. Everybody thinks it's a seltzer based on what the cans look like. Uh, it is 20% alcohol, 40 proof. So it does pack a little punch if you're drinking a couple of them. So. Ted's going to have a really good day today. <laughs> it's, five <o> <laughs> <o 'clock somewhere. laughs> it's 5 o'clock somewhere. This is really good. So where where can you locally buy these? Can you go to one of the wine stores? Yeah, so we got a um, big Orlando, or I should say Orlando has a couple different liquor stores that have it. Um, in the Kissimmee area, we also have a couple of slushy machines that are downtown. Um, like I was telling Ted earlier, um, we give away free slushy machines to restaurants. Uh, once the catch, you got to buy the product to uh, run it through the machines as a base, but it comes out as a nice frozen drink once once it's said and done. So Deliciously dangerous is how I'm going to say. This is so good. It doesn't taste like I'm no alcohol, but I know there's alcohol in it. All right, what are we tasting next? I love this one. This is the Arnold Shine, right? Yeah, Arnold Shine. Arnold Shine. So next we can go off to the... Uh, Shine Mary sweet tea. Um, I don't know That's if you've good. ever had like a cold brew tea, but, but this obviously has like alcohol in it. Um, Look, Shine Berry sweet tea. Oh my God. I love, yeah, it's it's a great. It smells, great it smells like a cold tea, I think. Too. Oh yeah, it smells so good. So this berry. is sweet tea, berries, flavored shine. I love that it's called sip shine. Come on, how can you not be happy when you're drinking this? Just puts a smile on it. It puts your <laughs> It makes us shine even more. So how's it going to work, my, uh, Michael Westmeyer, um, with Michael Ferdima's product, for example? Are there so going to be... you come to the event in the venue, the Cheyenne Saloon, on October 22nd, a nightmare before a nightmare on Church Street, <laughs> Sip Shine is going to have an area there designated to showcase their products for everyone to sample like we're sampling today. God, so and cool. you're going to be able to sample what we're sampling. That's going to be amazing for them. Just like it was amazing for us. That is really good. Good. That's delicious. I love the samples because then you get to know which one you like and which one you don't like. And you have, we're going to taste a lot of products here, obviously. This is delicious too. Wow. It's a tough job, but somebody's got to do it. It's all for charity. It's all for charity. Base camp for kids, guys. Base camp, Children's Cancer Foundation. Uh, I happen to be on the board for that amazing organization. And so Base Camp does a lot with children's families and children who have cancer uh they do a lot of the services that fall through the cracks they try to bring back some normalcy to the kids lives and to the families' lives so i love the fact that base camp is going to benefit uh from the event all right tell us what's next michael frodima yeah so next we have watermelon uh chili um this is one of the more popular flavors uh, a watermelon chili yep so does it have a kick so this one comes in the bottle uh, as you can see, we as come in different should. Uh, shapes Look and sizes, that. but uh, it is a very watermelony color. Thank you. Uh, well, a chili. I love it. They say it has a chili finish, chili type of finish Cheers, on yes. it. I don't know if you've had to taste Cheers. that. Well, I smell it. Let's see what you think of that. That has a nice, a little, not a little bite, kick. but a little kick to Just it. I love that. So this one comes in a bottle, not the Sweet. packaging here. That's correct. Yep. Okay. We only have them in bottles currently in the state of Florida. But same alcohol content? Same alcohol content, yep. Just the Y'all don't bottle. think you're drinking, don't think you're sipping on a seltzer, just for the record. Yeah, uh, that is really good. That is really good. Wow. So, so before we get into the next one or whatever we're sipping next, Jackie, tell them what it's like in this day and age to be in the security safety business. Security safety. Well, that's, our, that's our number one priority. Um, more, more times than not, you know, some people, they put it as a second, you know, thought. But for us, you know, it's the first thing that comes to mind when going to an event or just being out in the city. Yeah. Uh, knowing that safety is, you know, number one is very important. Agreed. It must be an interesting world to live in, especially, but I'm very happy you're going to be there. Absolutely. Truly. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a, it, for all around, it's a good experience when you see that you have security that's on top of your job. And 
you guys will get firsthand experience to see, you know, how our staff operates and, you know, functions for an event like this. Keep us secure. Keep us, keep us secure. All right, what's up next, Michael? Yeah, so next, we're going to move on to some flavored whiskeys. Um, so Sipshine actually does own this Somebody's product, got to do it. Um, but it is called Coyote. Um, we have a peach flavored whiskey. Or this is, I'm sorry, this is the apple. Um, it's similar to a Crown Royal, but um, kind of re-engineered into a better price point of a bottle for restaurants, bars, or whatever the place you're trying to get it in. Um, right. Go ahead and give it a try. I know you already have tried some of the, I did. Some of the delicious. apples. Delicious. Right. Yeah. Let me tell you about that. I took a sip of it, and I thought there is absolutely no way, again, uh, from the from the alcohol perspective, you don't have any of that bite that a lot of these have. It just has a nice natural flavor to it. It's delicious, and it smells so good. Smooth, smooth, just like you, Michael. Smooth. I've been holding on to that one for a while. <laughs> Appreciate that. So the whiskeys, though, are bought same places you can get sip shine. Uh, yep. So the same distributor carries the whiskeys as uh, the sip shine does. Um, like I was saying before, sip shine does own the brand. But we're trying to rebrand it into our own um, sip shine kind of whiskey as well. So that just to give you so an idea. Good. So, so, God, God, that's good. It smells just like apple, too. So. Delicious. It it's is. got a good nose to it. It's awesome, honestly. Oh, oh, Delicious. Oh, you know <laughs> Oh, look, you're getting into it, Jackie. I like it. We're opening up the palate. We're going to say all these words that we don't maybe know, but I can, I'm can. i going to tell you I think I know what palate means. Um, all right. That was Okay, so yeah, so we can move on to the peach now. Um, Go ahead and peach. try that out. Uh, like peach. I said, they both smell how they are. Uh, peach. Yeah, same brand name. Um, like I said, it's similar to a Crown Royal. Uh, but, uh, and I want you guys to see it because Coyote is spelled K-Y-O-D-I-E. Right? Yep. I love it. I love that. This All is thirty-five percent right. alcohol, seventy proof. So, like any any kind of flavored whiskey, it's typically that proof for the alcohol content. It smells delicious. Wow. Pretty good, right? Biting into Jackie, I'm in your way. Yeah. Just like biting into a peach. That's for another show, Michael. Um, we, <laughs> <laughs> this is so good, y'all. So they're going to be, are they going to be able to uh, sample this as well? Uh, yep. Yeah. Um, we're going to be able to sample everything that you guys have here. Coyote, as well as organic peak whiskey that will be coming into our um, warehouse. Um, before the event starts, which is a regular um, blended whiskey, just a straight straight whiskey, not flavored. So that's something to look forward to as well. So. Are, are you happy all the time when you're doing these? I would be happy 24-7. I'm, I'm I, so I mean, I'm a teacher 24-7, yeah. but I think this is amazing because you're really, really putting out a good product and you're having a good time. And we're doing it for charity. Everything is going to, uh, everything afterwards is going to benefit Base Camp, Children's Cancer Foundation. All right, so last but not least, we have one more, I think. No? I think that was it. Oh, did we? Oh. Raspberry Shining. Oh, uh, raspberry Shining. We, we skipped, we skipped over one. Fantastic. We're coming back to the... So this one here, it's kind of interesting. It's very sweet. It's got a kind of, I uh, should say, has a cotton candy finish on the end of it. Uh, sweet like Ted. <laughs> you know, I was going to say that about you. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, oh, Jackie. You I'm, I'm blocking you, Jackie. Come on in. It's all good. As you can see, some, some, some of the liquors are clear. Some, are, some have a color to it, just kind of the way they're produced. They all have a great fragrance. Um, all right, you can smell them. You can taste them. It's all very. Everyone has their own opinion on it. But Eileen Winfrey, if you're watching, you would love this. Um, this is really up your alley. This will sneak up on you. And so what I want you to remember is Sip Shine is not a seltzer. Um, it is definitely not. And so you want to def definitely take a look and see what you're drinking. But I love all the different flavors that you guys offer. Amazing cocktails. Appreciate it. Amazing. We're excited to have you there, Nightmare yeah. on Church Street, October 22nd, Benefit Base Camp for Kids. That's right. All right. You all tell them, Jackie, Michael, and Michael, what's the best way to reach everybody and find out more about your companies and about the event? Yeah, so you can go on sipmoonshine.com. I know the website is currently <laughs> under construction, but you can find us on Facebook and Instagram. Just type in Sip Moonshine, and uh, we're posting every day about new products and events coming up, so you can check us out that way, too. So. 
Fantastic. Appreciate the exposure. Facebook. I'm excited. Jackie, how about you? Yep. Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, uh, the Ewing Family Security and Security and Staffing Services. I'm sorry. And our website, uh, it's tfstaffing.com. Uh, you can reach us anyway through email. Uh, we can set up for uh, consultations, anything of that nature. All right. And so when I need my bodyguard against Michael Westmeyer back there, um, I have to reach out to you. <laughs> Michael, tell them the best way to find out more about A Nightmare on Church Street. Of course, through all social media, our website, mavicevents.live. But most importantly, yeah, all social media, A Nightmare on Church Street, October 22nd. You're going to see us there. We're going to see you there. Can't wait. All right, gentlemen, thank you so much. This was amazing. You guys are always asking me for fun events. And this one actually is benefiting base camp children's cancer foundation why not get out have a great time and give back we appreciate you guys appreciate you all we'll see you soon it's october 22nd which is coming up guys it's coming up a month less get than a costumes. month get your costumes uh and it's on church street so we'll see you guys soon